After creating a new company, we will learn how to create a new user. So, if we enter the system. In the system toolbar, we go down to general setup. Then, we have permission settings. In permission settings, we have roles and permissions, and users and roles button. So, if we press on roles and permissions, here we create new role which is before the user so that we can link them together. Let's create new role we call it data entry. And we save it. When you click on the data entry role, you'll have on top the permission setting, then you'll get all the buttons of the system, and you can choose the required features. You can mark them all in one click or unmark it all. So here I can mark them all and it will automatically mark the whole features, I save them and then I exit. Now at users and roles you have the admin by default, and you can create more users by clicking add. We enter username, and we give him a login name. In the password field, I enter the password, and I confirm the password and then save. I can create one more user by clicking new. I enter username, login name, we define the password, and we confirm it then save it. By this, we have created users but without defining their permissions. When we click on user roles and you can define users and choose roles created before either administrator or data entry. We press on user 2, we go to user roles, we link it to administrator role, and we save it. So, from now on, whenever you enter the system, you can select the user that has the defined permission. Thank you.